Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to WWE 2K18, my career mode alternate edition. We're live from Birmingham, Alabama. And what a night it's going to be, two nights after the Royal Rumble. Here we go, opening up the show is the former WWE World Heavyweight Champion. Lost last night against Randy Orton, of course. But uh, we were wondering, the authority had promised that they were going to be out there to watch Marcus against Randy and perhaps help him. And they weren't there. So let's see what Marcus has to say tonight. Last um, two nights ago at the Royal Rumble, I lost the WWE World Heavyweight Championship fair and square. But tonight, I'm going to forget all about the Rumble because tonight, I'm cashing in my rematch clause for the title against Randy Orton tonight. And that will be the main event. So, let's speak about the topic of the authority. Now, apparently they have a problem with me. And, well, we all know that I am the one who's best for business in this company. So I want to know exactly what the authority have against me. Because we were meant to be partners in crime, partners in time, whatever. Whatever you want to talk about. So Shane, if you have a problem with me, let's come out and settle it like real people. And just keep our relationship and friendship intact. Is the commissioner going to come out? Yes! Shane McMahon. Is coming out. Here we go. And we're on a bumpy road to WrestleMania, especially for Marcus. Let's see what Shane wants. You know, it's such a pity that you've already booked yourself in a match for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship tonight because next up is you versus me, apparently, according to the board of directors, that the authority do not want you here anymore. You've disappointed us time and time again. Oh, how funny. I disappointed you. I have carried this brand on my back. For the past year, two years, even that, I have been the one who's boosted up the ratings, champion or not champion, I have made SmackDown Live what it is. There is no doubt about your accomplishments here on SmackDown Live, but we honestly don't need you here anymore. The ratings are good, Randy Orton is the WWE World Heavyweight Champion, and he is what's best for business. You said that before about Randy and what happened. It all went through the roof, didn't it? It went through the floor, more like. Look, if you're gonna ditch me, then you're making a huge, huge mistake. And if I gotta be a match against you tonight, I'm gonna beat that into you. Oh, you're no better than a toddler whining over a spilled milk. Why don't you grow up and learn to talk like real men do, with our fists? The way I see it, you've got two options. You can be a real man and fight, or you can walk back up that ramp and pour yourself a new glass of milk. You against me is next. You gotta deal with it. I don't see why you guys are just ditching me. I don't get it. I honestly do not get it. Look, I'm sorry, but this is what's best for business. This is the WWE. We gotta do what's best for business, and you are no longer best for business. You are no longer the future, you're getting a bit old for that now. Bullshit! How the hell is Randy Orton the future of this company? Randy Orton is a decade older than me. And you're telling, you're telling me that I ain't the future of the company anymore? You're telling him that he's the future? You know what? The authority's just full of fucking lies. I'm done with you guys. I'm gonna whoop your ass tonight, and then I'm gonna go ahead and reclaim the title. Or whatever, I just had enough of this crap. Get back in the back, get ready for your match, just like I'm gonna get ready for mine. I'll see you tonight. 
when I whoop your ass coast to coast. Wow. Shane making a statement. We're going to see Shane McMahon versus Marcus Paul from the next on SmackDown Live. And as you can see, it's true. Marcus Polferman got to go against Shane McMahon, and then straight after, he's going one-on-one -on -one with Randy Orton. I wonder what's going to happen. We'll see in this episode tonight. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and listen to the salvation. Marcus Polferman here tonight. And a great reaction from the crowd right here tonight. Making a quick entrance. You can see a bit of a shocked look on his face. The crowd cheering for him again. He hasn't been a baby face since he was in NXT last time. And the authority no longer backing this man. I wonder what's going to happen on this bumpy road to WrestleMania. But after this match, Rox is going to be in a match against Randy Orton for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. So uh, let's see what's going to happen. Of course. People say the chances are of him winning are slim, but remember, in the past year, Marcus has only lost two matches. They were against big superstars John Cena and Randy Orton. And listen to this booing. They're booing Shane McMahon out of the building. Wow. Wow, they really are booing this man out of the building. The leader of the authority here on SmackDown Live. Wow. Shane McMahon. I don't know what's going to happen here tonight. I guess we're about to find out. Here we go. And the match is underway. And these two are going to lock up in very quick fashion right here. Mark is going to get out of it. Wrenching right here. And look at this. Huge takedown by the former champion. And he's going to let him go. What the? I can't fucking Irish whip. And look at this. Working right into the ropes here. Look at this. Oh, and a cheap shot. By Marcus right there. Look at this. Irish whip. Shame it, man. Bouncing off the ropes. Look at this. Beautiful German suplex, Marcus. Making the cover, and uh, there you go. Big kick out by Shane McMahon right there. Spinning heel kick by Marcus. Big kick to the side. And look at this. Looking for something here. And look at that. Shane O'Mac. Back in control right here. Of course, Shane McMahon. Two nights ago, the Royal Rumble. Part of the final two. And Zach Polferman ended up eliminating him and becoming... The number one contender for the for either title. We don't know what he'll be going for. Rumors are stating that Zach wants to go for the Universal Championship, but he could also go for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. So I guess we'll see what happens. We're just jumping over Shane here. Look at this. Oh, look at that Shane. Oh, we went for a jab. And look at this. Marcus got out of it. These two are going back and forth now. These two really are going back and forth. Oh, what a knee. And look at these. Look at these strikes by Marcus Polferman. Marcus Polferman's been near enough unstoppable lately. Of course, Randy Orton getting a huge win over him at the Royal Rumble. And there's the X-Plex. Marcus going to hook the leg, looking right at the referee. One kick out. Look at this. Oh! What a maneuver. And Marcus straight away. He wants to hit this in very quick fashion. Is he going to connect? Yes, he does. Sweet chin music. Could be it. One. Two. Shane kicks out. And look at this. He's ready. Boom! Riding the bullet. Marcus Polferman. You can see the anger. Look at this. Hook of the leg. One. Two. And Shane gets the kick out. Shane McMahon gets the kick out. Wow. Can he heel kick? No. Shane McMahon with a big takedown right there. Look at this. Oh! Oh, 
Oh my god! Those strikes from Shane right there. Could be it. No! Mark is kicking out in very, very quick fashion right there. And look at this. Shane McMahon trying to slow the pace down. You know he's already took a beating tonight. And just slams him down. There you go. Shame it, man. Looking for something there. Marcus flips out of it. Look at this. What's this? Drop kick. Wow. Oh, what a strike. Down goes Shane. And Marcus once again setting it up. Look at this. Boom! No! Shane got out of it. Shame it, man. Oh, what a suplex. Look at this. Oh, what a DDT. What's he looking for here? Oh, look at this. Some sort of arm, arm lock triangle hold. Can Marcus get out of it? Look at the strength! Oh my god! And look at this, these two are going back and forth. Oh, what an elbow. What a punch. What a kick. What an elbow again. Look at this. Oh, look at these strikes right here. These punches in the corner. Ten punches in the corner and the last one busts him wide open. Here we go. Marcus getting fired up right here tonight. With these elbow drops right here. Wow, look at these elbow drops. Boom. It's over ladies and gentlemen. Marcus has completely out-wrestled Shane McMahon, winning the bullet number two. That's it. Good night, Shane. One, two, no, and Shane. Shane McMahon will not give up. Shane McMahon will not give up, and look at this. What's this? Again, looking for some kind of fisherman suplex. Northern Lights suplex by Shane. Shane right now with a huge opportunity. Angle slam. Looking for a quick cover. One. No, oh, and all he can get is a one count. And Marcus rolling out of harm's way right now. Oh my god, what a European uppercut. Flying European uppercut by Shane. What a close line. Look at this. These two going back and forth on the outside right here. Look at this. Look at this! Back at Connor! No! Shane McMahon getting out of it again. The count is at four. Are these two going to get... Oh, and Shane getting back inside the ring right here. Marcus following suit. Look at this. Shane was being a bit cocky there. And Marcus makes him pay. Look at this now. What's this? Oh, my God. What a knee. Oh my god, putting loads of force behind that. Shane is taking a beating. And another shot to the head coming up, ladies and gentlemen. This could be it. Boom, no! Oh my god, that came out of nowhere. Oh my god, what? He missed the super kick. And he hit him with a massive knee. And this is it now. Boom! He gets it. He finally gets it, ladies and gentlemen. Lifting up Shane right here. Look at this. Trying to win it here. One, two. Shane kicks out. Coming off the ropes right now. Boom! Riding the bullet number three. Good night, Shane! One, two, no! What the hell? 
has Marcus got to do to beat Shane right here tonight? These two have both took a beating, but I'm surprised Shane is still in this. Again, Shane now has got Marcus. Oh, look at that. Fails right there. Here we go. Look at this, Maca Cutter! All he has to do is get him back inside the ring. That's all he has to do. And he does, he gets him back inside the ring right now. Boom. Marcus now getting inside the ring. Marcus coming off the ropes again, riding the bullet number four. That is, if that's not it, I honestly swear to God. One, two, three. Marcus Polferman defeats Shane McMahon, but I don't think that'll be enough for him, really. I guess we'll see. Shane put up a huge fight, but of course, talent will always win in this situation. Once again, Marcus comes out on top. And what a victory for Marcus tonight, but he's got to wait for the WWE World Heavyweight Champion. And of course, Marcus is tired, but he's going to keep going because he wants that title that Randy Orton currently holds. And here he comes, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, this entrance actually looks insanely good with Randy Orton. Marcus waits for the champion. Wow. Here he comes, ladies and gentlemen. the champions defending his title tonight and the the odds are severely stacked in his favor and here we go this is what it's all about ladies and gentlemen the WWE World Heavyweight Championship is on the line here we go, Marcus Polferman, Randy Orton, here we go, and Marcus getting out of harm's way in very quick fashion, of course he's tied after a big match with a, uh... oh what a strike, he put a lot of force behind that big match with uh, Shane McMahon of course, and Marcus really, really, really has the odds severely stacked against him. Looking for a snap suplex. Marcus is trying his best, you can tell. And look at this. What's this now? Oh, and he tosses him outside the ring. Oh, and he went for that elbow drop. Look at this. Oh, and he went for it again and Randy Corton this time. This is big trouble for Marcus so far. Oh, look at that spinning heel kick. Look at this. Right into the barricade goes Randy Orton. And what's this now? Marcus, one wicked angel driver on the outside. Here we go. And now, oh, right into the steel steps. And he resets the count right here.
Look at this. Oh. Marcus, oh god, look at this. And Marcus getting away from Randy in very quick fashion, and he gets his back inside the ring. What a punch, oh my god. Look at this, oh, Marcus hanging on. And look at that. Oh, what a punch by Marcus, making sure Randy doesn't turn in his face. And there's that spinning heel kick that we saw from Jordy last night. Boom! A chance! There's a chance for Marcus! Here we go! Boom! Super kick! One kick out by Orton! Wow! Look at this now! Look at this! Boom! Riding the bullet! That's the fifth one he's hit tonight! Orton not doing very well! One! Oh my! Wow! Orton kicked out very quick. Of course, Orton in almost pristine condition. He hasn't even had a match tonight. The authority giving him an easy match. A punch again. There's another one. And there's another one. No, Orton. Look at this. Oh, what a punch. Sends it behind. Back. Still back to Marcus. Orton now getting fired up. What a punch. Goals line by Orton. The third generation superstar. Look at this. And a vintage power slam. And we're about to see vintage Orton with these stomps right here. Vintage Randy. Here we go. What a punch. And a DDT. This is it. Marcus has got to get out of this one. And oh, there's the RKO. That's it. One, two, three. And I think now that Marcus has lost his rematch, that puts him out of contendership for the title. Look at this. Boom. He gave it a good go. But Orton was in really, really good condition. Look at this. Oh, my God. Randy Orton retains the WWE World Heavyweight Championship tonight. And now he's got to look forward to the el Elimination Chamber match. Guys, I want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of WWE 2K18, My Career Mode Alternate. What is going to happen in the story of Marcus Pulperman? And what is going to happen on this road to WrestleMania?